Hey everybody, Jermaine and I are in Charlotte, North Carolina this weekend and we are going to be recapping some of our favorite places to eat. If you have watched any of our previous foodie videos, you know when it comes to food, Jermaine and I do not lie. If it's nasty, we're going to tell you it's nasty and if it's delicious, we're going to tell you it's delicious. So if you came to this video looking for some honest reviews and feedback on restaurants in Charlotte, North Carolina, you have come to the right place. Let's hop right on into the video. Hi, we're Saida and Jermaine, the creators of ApronsAndStilettos.com. Thanks so much for watching our video to the end and subscribing. Your engagement lets us know you're enjoying our videos and helps us understand what you want to see more of. So our first stop is going to be a restaurant that we ate at for breakfast. It is called Eero and it is located in the Hyatt-centric Charlotte South Park. And that is located at 3100 Apex Drive. Eero is located on the second floor of the Hyatt Centric and it is open to the public as well as guests. Jermaine and I were staying at this particular Hyatt, which is why we ate breakfast here and we were not disappointed. Let's take a look at what we ate. We ate here two mornings that we were in Charlotte. We ordered the milk bread French toast with house made milk bread, oyster, honey butter, Greek yogurt, blueberry compote, and a side of bacon. I really, really enjoyed this French toast, and I highly recommend it. What about you, Jermaine? Did you like it? I mean, I did. Uh, when I first saw it coming out, I was like, yeah. But it ended up being pretty good. Yeah, the Greek yogurt on top and the um, butter, it was definitely good. And the blueberry compote, was it was really good. I liked it. That's a nice spread there. Anything else? Oh, yeah. No, I think that's everything. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For breakfast on day two, I ordered the avocado toast and Jermaine ordered the three egg gyro omelet. We both had a side of bacon and a bowl of fresh fruit. And pig on the side of it, though. What is that in there? Um, peppers, spinach, and um, peppers, spinach, and uh, mushrooms. Okay. For lunch, we headed over to the Soul Food Meat Company in the South End. Soul Food Meat Company is located at the corner of South Church and West Bland Streets in downtown Charlotte. This Korean-inspired barbecue restaurant was recommended by one of Jermaine's buddies, so we knew we wanted to try it. So we noticed when we arrived that the restaurant had seating both inside and outside. We chose to sit inside out of the sun, but we were still able to enjoy a cool breeze from the open concept dining room. From the menu, we ordered the crispy pork belly, and then we ordered a side of dirty brown rice, which comes in either brown or white rice. We also ordered the spicy barbecue and sweet and mild wings, along with the soy pork spare ribs and the Dwing Jong collard greens. So the question that most of the times people want answered about restaurants that we eat at is, how did the food taste? And I'll let you guys know that everything was good here. The only thing I would say is to ask them to cook the chicken just a little bit longer. Unless you like a little cluck in your chicken. I like my chicken a little bit more crispy and less, uh, I guess, kind of um, softer skin. So if you're like that, you probably want to ask them to cook your chicken just a little bit longer. Okay, so I'm going to try this on camera so I can tell y'all what it actually tastes like. I think this one is the spicy um, chicken wings. Okay. The sauce on the outside is good. Mm, I can't get to the inside. Hold on. Okay. These are good. So the other one is the sweet and spicy, I think. Good too. Oh, good. I, ain't lying. <laughs> I like the, the, the ribs. ribs better than the chicken. Okay. Jermaine said the ribs are better than chicken, so I gotta try them. So, this is the rib. I didn't taste the sauce. Mm. The bright chicken. The ribs are good too. Yeah, the ribs are good. Really good. I like them. Get tender. Now, I got some fat stuff between my teeth. Mm -hmm. 
but I bought my um um floss because I already knew that it was gonna be an issue. I like this sauce better too that over here. Oh yeah? Mm-hmm. I don't so, know which one is which. What's this place called? Soul Food Cafe? Soul Korean. Mm-mm. Soul Korean. Yeah, Soul Food Soul Meat Market. Soul Meat Market. Okay. All right. Mm -mm. He's fat. So now I'm gonna try the collard greens. Mm. The collard greens are good too. Oh, everything is good here. I'm not gonna tell y'all no lie. Y'all know I always tell y'all the truth when it comes to food. If it's nasty, I'm gonna tell you it's nasty. If it's good, I'm gonna tell you it's good. And this is really good. Mm-hmm. This is really good. Do you recommend this place, baby? Mm -hmm. Jermaine gives it a thumbs up. He recommends it. We're in Charlotte all the time. I think we found us another gem. So we have two gems in Charlotte. We may do a review of our other gem, but we're not going there tonight. At least I don't think. We're trying to try another new place tonight. But this place is definitely good. I'll make sure. I link tag them down in the description box. And one other quick side note, there's a lot of murals and great places to take photos around this restaurant, so make sure you walk around just a little bit if you want to grab some photos. So after enjoying lunch, later on that evening, we headed over to Swirl, which is a cupcake shop in Oakhurst area, to get some cupcakes. This is a cute little colorful made-to-order cupcake shop that has a lot of different cake options you can choose from, frostings you can choose from, and toppings you can choose from. This was our first time trying it out, and we were not disappointed. Again, I tell you, when I tell you guys something was good, I promise you it was good. And if it wasn't good, I promise you it wasn't good. But these cupcakes were really delicious. Swirl also has some really unique cookies, but we didn't order any cookies. We only had enough room for a limited amount of dessert, but let me tell you what we actually ordered. I ordered the Alice and the Cleo, and Jermaine ordered two Jasmines. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and add it to your watch list so you can find it later, and subscribe so you don't miss out on our future videos. Thanks so much for watching.